What's going on you guys? Lynx Forte here to bring you my week six battle going up against my boy Kyle A and his Miami Don fans. He's gonna tell you that he's the only team that matters. No, not today. It's all about the South Florida Bulus today, man. So I'm gonna just uh, select these rules real quick and I'm gonna tell you guys what I'm bringing. Give me one second. All right, so this is the team that I am bringing. Florida just is supposed to be blue. I, I messed that up, that's on me. But yeah, Florida just supposed to be blue. But the team I am bringing, if I can find it, just to make sure I have everything right. I am bringing Quagsire with Ice Beam, Earthquake, Toxic Recover, Fully Fizz Death, it's unaware. That was for on his team, the unaware part of it anyway, was just to like avoid any setup from like a Haxorus. Um, maybe even the Scizor, like a SD Scizor or something like that. Um, I got Flame Charge, Dazzling Gleam, Blue Flare, Energy Ball, E Belt, Victini, uh, Scizor with Lychee Berry, Swords Dance, Bug Bite, Bullet Punch, Natural Gift. It, um, Natural Gift with the Lychee Berry makes it a base 100 grass type move. It has 76 speed, and if I'm not mistaken, that was to make sure. Uh, I want to say I outsped Seismitoad. Like, I don't remember how much investment, though. <laughs> I can't remember. Uh, Florges has a Kebia Berry to make sure I... Um, and it's EV to make sure I live... I think it's a plus one Poison Jab from Haxorus. Moonblast Psychic, Energy Ball Wish. Um, Mega Venusaurs here. Mixed Defenses, Knock Off Synthesis, Sludge Bomb. Um, HP Fire, Dredagon, Rocky Helmet, Gunk Shot, Stealth Rock, Sucker Punch, Thunder Punch. Um, Thunder Punch because he has Tabu Coco and Electric Terrain. That's the reason Gunk Shot is also there. So I'm going to get this started. He's probably waiting for me. Yep, he's been waiting for me, man. I'm surprised he didn't just message me like, Yo, Lynx, what are you doing? I'm talking, all right? I got to give people some information. I built this team like three weeks ago. Si Yo. I think the, I, I knew five of these six were coming, Weezing I wasn't a hundred, a hundred on, but Weezing makes a lot of sense. What else did he have on his team that he could have prob probably, uh, I can't talk, probably have brought, if I can find my doc. Um, oh, the Haxorus, I was expecting Haxorus to come, okay, but that's, it's cool. So, Mega Scizor. Top of Coco, Weezing. So Seismitoad is his only rocker. Um, it probably, honestly, is carrying uh, a Rindo Berry just to avoid any grass moves I have. I don't have a choice card for y'all. I just kind of realized that. Seismitoad. And Halucha. Um, I'm expecting Tapu Coco to have uh, like Brave Bird. Yo, isn't okay. So I'm Rocky Helmet. I'm Max Bedef on Dredagon. So if I remember correctly, it allowed me to live a Dazzling Gleam. I'm gonna go and check that real quick, but I'm leading Dredagon, um, potentially get up my rocks depending on what he wants to lead with. <clears throat> Top of Coco. Yo, I forgot which mons are his Z mon. Let me pull that back up. Haxorus and Coco. Okay. So I gotta be mindful about that. Look at that scissor lead, man. Uh, I'm going to just go ahead and get my rocks up here. Let me see. He has Coco and Scizor to remove him. Halucha, unlikely. But uh, he's probably just going to U-turn out. I'm going to just go ahead and get these rocks up, though. I didn't bring Defog. Really should have. But I mean, the only mine that I would have brought on was 
Florges. Man. The fact that he didn't bring Haxorus, I'm not saying it messes me up, but it's kind of annoying. But yeah, I'm going straight for the rocks. Uh, I want to check this Coco. Yeah, even Choice Specs Coco with Dazzling Gleam does not Oko uh, Dragon from full. It does 82.6 if he's timid. Um, if he is modest, it does 91%. So, just depending on how much chip I allow Dragon to take. And then Gunk Shot does a lot of damage as well. So, <clears throat> but yo, this is the first time I'm bringing Dragon. I think at this point it means for Special K. Is this uh, Tapu? No. Nope. So I think what I think with Dragon coming this this week, it means that every Pokemon has officially come to a battle. It just took six weeks for Dragon to finally come. All right. Now we gotta decide what we're going into. Weezing is here. If this thing is like physically defensive, can I get Victini in? Can I get Victini in to take like a Sludge Bomb potentially? Victini takes 30% from Sludge Bomb. I could Flame Charge up. And that way I'm outspeeding everything on his team, but ah, P2. I can go into Mega Venom. I go into Mega Venom and click knockoff. Basically is what I'm thinking. Do I want to take a Venusaur? If he has Flamethrower. I'm going to take a small chunk. I'm going to go into Venom though. Yeah, there's the Willow. I could have gone in a Victini for almost free. Yo, we're going to click this knockoff. I'm assuming he just goes in. Oh, he stayed in. I was not expecting him to stay in. Is he expecting me to go for Leech Seed? Don't have it. So Sludge Bomb will do the most. I don't have a, a Grass move this week. I didn't think it was necessary, honestly. I have other ways. I don't see him switching in a Seismitoad on a, Ven on a Mega Venusaur. So there was really no need for me to bring a Grass move. Um, there were other things that were bigger threats in my eyes, but uh, Sludge Bomb does the most damage to this thing. What would he switch in? I'm gonna click Sludge Bomb. He probably will stay in. Uh, depending on the Mega Scizor set, like I think Mega Scizor would have to be max speed. No, not max speed, but he would need a lot of speed investment to outspeed me. Um, let's see, Mega Scizor. If he's offensive, he doesn't need a whole lot because like I don't have any speed investment, but he needs about. 52-ish. Maybe only 48. Yeah, he only needs 44, actually. If he's adamant, anyway. But, I don't think he brings in Mega Scizor, because I might try and predict that. Alright, so he did switch out for Jake. This is... Oh, he brought the Scizor in. Alright. So I can eat an Aerial Ace, I can eat an Aerial Ace, and I can do about 72% to this Scizor. Oh wait, that's not max attack. I can still eat one though, because he does about 55% to me. Oh wait, 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 I forgot about this. 
Uh, all right. I was just about to question why this scissor has damage on it, but I have rock soap. I do a good chunk to this thing, depending on his investment. Yo, I'm gonna click HP fire. I could have just roosted, honestly. Oh, uh, he switched. I should have, or not, I said roosted. I could have just clicked synthesis. I didn't even think about him having all the pivot. He's got Coco and Scizor. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if he goes Coco here. For homeboy. Yep, Coco. Couldn't go for synthesis because I was still taunted. Um, so my typical switch ins to a Coco would be Quagsire. However, Coco does get Grass Knot. Um, he can run HP Fire. I really feel like he's just gonna go for a Brave Bird. I feel like he's just gonna go Brave Bird. How much does that do? If he is Z Brave Bird, I'm in range even without a Z. Alright, so since he did not bring Haxers, how much use? is Quagsire like it would be nice to have been able to been able uh, it would have been nice to be able to toxic seismitoad but I don't know if that's going to happen right now so let's just go for Quagsire I feel like he's gonna have grass not no matter what though haha <laughs> Z, Z uh, I called that yeah Z Braver This is doing this is doing less than fifty to me. Unless he's adamant. <clears throat> so that did thirty seven percent. He's special with uh, Brave Bird. So he's going to have Grass Knot. He's going to have Grass Knot. Uh, I'm going to go... Going into uh, Dredagon. Expecting this grass knot. Let's go! <clears throat> so, I don't think at this point I'm forced to go for Gunk Shot, am I? Am I forced to go for Gunk Shot? He's uh, just over 25. Yeah, Thunder Punch doesn't do the damage. And I still take a uh, Dazzling Gleam. So 
So, gotta go for Gunk Shot. Yo, please do not predict me again and go into Scizor. Oh, come on! <sighs> Alright, so we've seen Brave Bird, Volt Switch, and Grass Knot. I'm thinking HP Fire is his last move. Four Special K, okay, that's the, uh, no, it's the Weezing. I'm just thinking about something. I just remembered that Weezing outsped Venusaur. That boy got a lot of speed on this Weezing. That boy got a lot of speed on Weezing. So I think he goes P2 here. Try to synthesis up with Venusaur. Yo, how many turns are we? 10 turns, that's it? Oh man, it feels like we've had so many turns. I gotta figure out a way to break his team, man. I gotta figure out a way to break his team. Coco is sitting at just above 25, so it still has like two rock switch ins. I really feel like P2 is his play here. Because there's no thing, there, I don't have anything that will one shot it. Like, I don't even think, like, a Z Brick Break or a Z Focus Blast could could do it. For B more. Oh, Seismitoad. All right, he's going to switch. No leftovers. So yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure he has um I'm pretty sure he has a Rando Berry. I'm gonna synthesis up. Like even if he stays in, he definitely has a Rando Berry. What have I shown him? On Venusaur. I've shown him Sludge Bomb. I've shown him HP Fire and Knock Off. I just want to see if like he has a uh, defensive Seismitoad. Would that take it out? Would a uh, Giga Drain take it out if I had it? Yeah, he stayed in. So he's Rindo Bear.
I'm just gonna click knock off on. So he's seen my fourth move. Yo, that did zero. Oh, I'm burned. <laughs> I was just thinking, I'm like, that did zero. Seismitoad has speed on it as well. Yo, he did a lot to make sure he outsped Mega Venu. Let's see, Seismitoad. Um, what can Floor just do? I can actually kill it. Uh, do you get you get poison job, right? I think you get poison job. I think you get poison job. I have caviar bear, but do you have anything else? Oh, wheezing. I'm just assuming right now this thing gets poison job, like worst case scenario. Earthquake doesn't do a whole lot. Um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go into Florges. If he wants to go into Weezing, I click Psychic on it. Oh, he got behind the sub. So. Stealth Rocks, Earthquake, Sub. He's max attack. This man is max attack. So he's probably max speed, max attack. And he's probably, actually, he probably went for sub to avoid like a toxic on a. Quack from Quagsire. I'm gonna click Energy Ball. I think he's just gonna take me out here, though. Yep. I actually hate that he brought so much speed, man. Let me think about Scizor right now. Because I don't think I can outspeed like a max speed, max attack, or Seismitoad. He just has a lot of speed, I know that. Yeah, I don't have enough to outspeed the Seismitoad. Is he gonna expect this? I feel like he should not expect this. Yo. What's an HP bar? 
I think I would actually have killed him through uh, Rando Bear. Mm, yeah, the, after Rocks, I would have killed him through Rando. Or maybe. It was a roll. He's actually done a lot to my team, and P2 is still in the back. Four drives this poor gun. Yup. Drives duck neck ass. <laughs> All right. We gotta think right now, people. Yo! Yo, we back. Me and Kyle got this whole thing straightened. I don't know if HP on certain mods is right, but you know what? We recreated the entire thing in one go. And what's the best thing you can hope for, man? Alright, so. I had a scissor on the fields. He's probably going to go for a T-Wave. He's probably going to go for a T-Wave. I don't think I should stay in, though. I don't think I should stay in. I feel like I just need to go into Quagsire. Kind of fearing like an HP Grass. Kind of fearing HP Grass, but I feel like... That's my best play. And then I just click Toxic. HP Grass doesn't... Oh, wait. It might kill me after Ox. Depending on what he goes for here. <clears throat> I feel like he has HP Grass, though. Oh, he went for Foul Play. Yo, this, this man is just... See, this is why Kyle is one of the greats. He just don't care. This man does what he wants, and I almost clicked SD. I'm gonna click Toxic though. Um, the only thing that comes in is Wheezing on a Toxic. Or maybe I should just click Recover. I feel like Recover is my best play right now. Yo, please don't have HP Grass. He got Toxic. Should've just clicked my Toxic. Could go back into Mega Venu. I really shouldn't though. I'm gonna click Toxic. Yo, that hurt. All right. I think I'm going to go into Mega Venu. <clears throat> Try Attack does about 23% to Mega Venu, just under Oh my goodness, man. Yo, watch this Porygon have a lot of speed, too.
Yo, I bet this Porygon has a lot of speed. Like, enough to outspeed no speed Mega Vino. How much would it need? Yo, that's a lot of speed. That is a lot of speed. So, do I sacrifice... The question right now is, do I sacrifice Mega Venu to click knockoff? I could get rid of Eviolite. If I got rid of Eviolite, Scizor can actually come in and just click Bug Bite. Can it just come in and click Bug Bite? Maybe not just yet. I'm a synthesis. Yo, look at the speed this man put on it. Oh my gosh. The speed. All right, now we... <laughs> I can't believe the speed this man put on his Pokemon. <laughs> I can't touch his team right now. All right, we we gotta we gotta think of something. Yo, I really cannot touch this thing. I think he's either going to recover here or switch because that thing is getting low. And as much health as I can keep on this, the better. Yep, he recovered. <clears throat> Let's see how much toxic damage he's taking. He just took 25%, okay. I think I'm gonna just click Ice Beam here, um, just in case he wants to switch out into something. Like I think Ice Beam is my best play, but it does nothing though. I think next turn he's taking 50% from Toxic. I can't remember the amount that it racks up after a while. I'm gonna click Ice Beam though. Quagsire still has use for Halucha though. What'd you go into? Did you go into Weezing? For Jake is Scizor. Dang. <laughs> that was a crit. <laughs> that was a crit. Scizor can start setting up on me. Based on his Pokemon, this this is gonna have speed as well. Wrong Scizor. <clears throat> he could just go for knockoff here.
trying to think what I should go into. I, like, I feel like Scizor is the play right now. And then after that, I go into Victini and maybe click Flame Charge. Because Quagsire is still good just in case. And because I know Weezing has enough speed to outspeed um, Mega Venu, I know he has enough speed to outspeed me, so he may just go into Weezing. He's not going to go into Coco because I could BP kill that. Weezing is what I think he goes into. P2 had enough speed to outspeed uh, Mega Venu. Yo, uh, I, I can't think how to get around this stuff, man. The only good thing right now is that um, Weezing's item is gone. Yeah, he went back into P2. See, this is the good thing, is that he's poisoned. The question is now, is, is he going to try and kill me? Because I could just say, hey, I'm going to go for the damage. Or I can try and set up because, honestly, like, probably a good thing to do. If I set up, if I go plus two, click bullet punch. He may go for a foul play here, just to kill me off. You know what? Going for the SD just in case he wants to recover. Because he's going to kill me if he attacks. Yeah, he just attacked. So I could have just gone for the BP, got the damage off, made sure that he was below half, I guess. But I think the Toxic is going to take him below half. So if I go Victini here, if I go Victini here, I click Flame Charge because I'm almost positive he's going to switch. At least I feel like he's going to switch. <laughs> What have I seen? I've seen try attack I've seen foul play. Oh, wait, wait, wait a second. Foul play, oh, after rocks. Because foul play, depending on how much investment he has, that'll take me, after rocks, it takes me down to 45%. Yo, <laughs> I'm just outside of range. And a BP from Mega Scizor would kill me. Let's go. I, I gotta do this right now. I gotta do this. Like, he has a lot of speed. I know that. So how much bulk does that take away from him? How much bulk does that take away from him? I don't know. Probably not enough. But if he has like attack investment, then he's gonna kill Victini here. But I have to make a play at this point. I, I feel like he's just gonna switch. Nope, he stayed in, went for foul play. He's going to kill me. Oh, he went for try attack. I should live this, right? That flame charge didn't do enough. <laughs> flame charge did not do enough. Otherwise, I would just click it again. I'm clicking blue flare. <sighs> Yo, wait. Halucha is an issue. Halucha is an issue. Halucha still outspeeds me.
I'm clicking blue flare though. If he goes Coco, he's just doing it to get up the, um... He's doing it to get up the, uh, what is it? And I don't outspeed Coco, or Halucha. If he goes Coco, he's doing it to get up the electric terrain. And that means he's obviously electric seed Halucha, which... Wouldn't surprise anyone to be honest. Oh, he's gonna BP me with Sizzle. I don't have a rock switch in, do I? No, don't have a rock switch in. I could save it for fodder, but it wouldn't mean anything. Yo, is Quagsire really my win con right now? I could live... Oh wait, it depends on his investment. And he's probably max. If I get a low roll, I actually live this. If I get a low roll, I live this. <laughs> Yo, let's go! <laughs> it, he probably is not heavily attack invested. Alright. I think P2 killed two Pokemon. I, I think I missed something. Um, P2 killed Scizor? Yeah. Alright y'all, we, we still here. We're still here. <sighs> I, I don't know how much attack investment he had. Um, I lived on eight from 32 so I lived on 4% he might not have had any like he might have had a lot of speed and the rest in bulk but it's still a roll like if he got a min roll on that bullet punch and he's adamant <sighs> alright can Victini pull this off yo can Victini pull this off I do not have psychic on Victini to deal with wheezing I'm just gonna say that now. <sighs> yo, unless Coco is, I, yo, I think even if Coco is Scarf, I outspeed it. No, he's not Scarf. Coco is not Scarf. We saw the Z move. We saw the Z move. I can go for another flame charge. I can go for another flame charge. Do I kill? Flame charge does. About 24%. If I go for another flame charge, I win. I'm pretty sure I win. Come on, Victini. Come on, Victini. Come on, Victini. Let's go, Victini. Let's go, Victini. Yo, even after his um, even after his seed pops, his electric seed pops, I should kill. Oh, I hope I kill. <laughs> let me let me check Halucha because Halucha hadn't taken any damage prior to this, but I should do a lot of damage. I should do a lot of damage. I'm at plus three speed. So hold on, he just took rocks. 
blue flare does a max of 90%. I have a 50-50 chance right now to kill depending on his investment. If he is max max, it's actually a 65%. Oh wait, 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 wrong attack, wrong attack. It's, yo, after rocks is guaranteed. Blue flare is a guaranteed. Oh wait, I got Dazzling Gleam too. I don't want to miss. I don't want to miss. That's the issue right now. I'm going for D-Gleam. Going for D-Gleam because I don't want to miss a blue flare. Oh, he's got bulk! It's all good. It's all good. I think, I think we're good. I think we're good. No, the question right now is, what do I go into? I think I can go into, um, he can't sub up unless he has Roost. Victini, like, just helped me get back in this. I don't know how much investment he has right now. Um, I'm gonna check Dredagon right now. I wanna see how much an electric terrain boost that Thunder Punch does. If we remove his flying typing. If he goes for a roost, it's not a big deal. I'm going for a Thunder Punch. Going for a thunder punch, yo. Sucker punch didn't do the damage. He's gonna have pain split on wheezing. Yo, he's gonna kill himself. All right, so um, Jardigan picks up the kill. Yo, this is coming down to the wire. <clears throat> All right. Uh, unfortunately, wait, he has, he has a lot of speed. I know that. I just don't know how much. But he has speed. <sighs> He's going to have pain split. How much is Quagsire going to end up doing to that wheezing after? <sighs> it's going to be a tough one, yo. He's going to burn me. That's the issue right now. He's going to burn me. So once I'm burned, I'm not doing anything. He went for a sludge bomb. Okay, I guess he's just going to take me out. Yo, I live! I'm gonna go for a sucker punch, get off some more damage. All right. Yo, it comes down to this, y'all. He's gonna click pain split right now. I know this. I know this. He's going to click pain split.
Yo, that gave him a lot more than I was hoping for. Oh man, I think I, I don't think I can pull this one off, you guys. I don't think I can pull this one off. <clears throat> he can't pants for me. I don't think he has. I think I have less HP than he does for him to pants for it. So it's not really going to do anything. This is the thing though, I think I can two-shot him. I think Quagsire can two-shot him. He went for Pain Split again. Yo, he actually got HP back? What? I could have sworn I had less than he did. No! Honestly, me going for Recover doesn't help. And I want to. Oh no! He went for a taunt. He was keeping me from going for his a recover. Oh, come on, Quagsire. <sighs> you guys, it comes down to this. I'm at 46%. I'm at, I mean, I'm at 46 HP. His sludge bomb should not kill me. However, my ice beam should, no matter how much HP he gets back. This ice beam should take him out. Yo, come on, come on, like unless he has a special attack investment, which I don't think he does, I don't think he did enough earlier that will warrant him having special attack investment, I know he has speed investment. Come on, come on, take this. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Yes! <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh. Yo, I'm so fucking hyped. <laughs> <laughs> yo man if you guys love that battle the way i did if you guys were sitting on the edge of your seats the way i was hit that thumbs up button i know i know like 90 percent of you guys if not 98 percent of you guys are already subbed to my boy cal go to his video show him some love and hope we can do this again later this season <laughs> Honestly, I don't want to because I'm scared. <laughs> oh, anyway, I'm going to get up out of here, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. This is Link's Forte. See you next week. I'm out. Peace.